Gerard Lotz admitted his role in the killings of Mati Goniwe, Fort Skalata, Sperum Konto and Sikelom Sauli, known as the Credit 4, 30 years ago. Lotz appeared before the TRC and confessed his part in the murder of the four men. He detailed how he and his colleagues from the security police planned and executed the murders. Lukanya Kalata, son of one of the victims, says lots of sins might have finally caught up with him. My mom always tells the story that she says that my father always said that if something were to ever happen to him, uh, he would haunt those people that actually uh, would bring him any harm. My mom is convinced that my father probably haunted him and got him to that place where it was easier for him to take his own life. According to Lotz's own testimony, Captain Saki Van Sale and Lieutenant Eric Taylor effected the plan to kill the Craydog 4. Lotz told the TRC he had to find a pattern for the four men's movements. They detained them and staged their deaths to look like vigilante attacks by other political organizations. Lotz and his accomplices were never convicted of the killings. Galata says Lotz might have taken the truth of what really happened that night to the grave. We can't have any closure because we don't know what the truth is, you see. The Mr. Lotz killing himself like this, you know, it, it's unfortunate, but it doesn't bring us any, any closer to knowing the truth. Galata is calling on those responsible for father's death to come forward and reveal the whole truth. Bonga Lulane, Cape Town.